Open fire! Tony, are you all right? Ow, ow, and more ow. <sighs> With these cosmic bricks, the world will be mine to rule. But first, I should probably prevent it from being destroyed. This would have been much easier had you captured the board intact rather than blasting it to pieces. The Avengers showed up. They know how to ruin every good evil plan. Your plan is still... fantastic. A poor choice of words, God of Mischief. I prefer to think of it as spectacular, maybe stupendous. I've hired every villain, bad guy and dark minion I could find. To help assemble Dr. Doom's Doom Ray of Doom. Sort of a mouthful, but all right. Speaking of that. Silence! Now we must track down more of these cosmic bricks to build my weapon. As you command, oh most doomful one. Bigwigs go! Once you bring me some of those uh, cosmic bricks! Why didn't they make me the supervisor here? That guy's got sand for brains! Holding Grand Central hostage at rush hour? Now that's criminal. Hope, you have to remember to look before you leap. I know, bad guys. The S.H.I.E.L.D. folks think we need to formulate a careful plan of attack using... Or we just smash our way in. Good plan. For taking the subway down to the bugle. Guess I'll just have to fight my way through it. Whoa! <clears throat> Thanks for swinging by, Spider Man. You Avenger guys are really great at making a mess. Hey, I just replaced that. Secure that cosmic brick, Coulson. Make sure it gets to the Fantastic Four's lab for analysis. Yes, sir. Uh, Hulk, can you help with some of this debris? <laughs> Hulk, 
You're calling them cosmic bricks? They came from the sky, sir, for you encounter. I've given Reed Richards the job of finding out why everyone seems to want them. Thanks for your help, Spider-Man. There's always a place in this operation for a hero like you. Like I have time for that. I've got a trigonometry exam tomorrow, and my aunt needs me to pick up a dozen eggs, and I'm drowning in angst. So, who's behind all this? What exactly are they up to? And will it cut into my hot tub time? I don't know, I wish I knew, and yes. Tony, get back to Stark Tower and try to get me some answers. <laughs> I must have all the cosmic bricks I can get my hands on. My work progresses. Progress faster. This is what I've been reduced to, relying on such pitiful mortal creatures for my plans, though he does have a cool throne and a metal face. Director Fury, Reed Richards is here. Uh... Oh, Mr. Fantastic himself. Any breakthroughs on that cosmic brick I sent you? Actually, I could use some help. Is Tony Stark around? He's working on something else. I have another Avenger here. I'm actually the first Avenger, sir. Do you have much experience with theoretical quantum mechanics and exotic nano-derived power sources? Uh... I got an A-plus in American history. Director Fury, we have confirmation that more of those bricks hit the open ocean. Hill, get me a shield research sub to gather those cosmic bricks. I want some answers. Cap, you head to the Baxter building with Reed Richards and help out the best you can. I can always sell some war bonds. Hill, another important thing. Lunch. Order in some shawarma. Stark knows the spot. The top five floors of the Baxter Building are home to the Fantastic Four. Up-to-date plans are unavailable, as Reed Richards is continuously reconfiguring the layout of his labs. Dr. Doom, it's Dr. Octopus. I found it. <clears throat> Parker! Do your job! I want some play for bugle stories on the net thing, or inner face! Yes, sir. Net face. You understand the web, don't you? The web? Yeah, it's a job and a hobby. Doc Octopus? You're a real doctor, right? Cause I have a pain right here, and it goes around there. Ooh, if I've been over there, then wow. Your cheap health plan doesn't cover office visits. I need some footage of this for the website. How hard could it be? I mean, this time the news is coming to us! You could record it with your smartphone, JJ, if you could figure out how to turn it on. Hey, guys. Give it up. Crime never pays. You'd be surprised. It covers medical and dental. 
can't escape the long reach of justice, Ark. Stop being so grabby, Doc. I got it! I got it! I got it! I got it. Yes! I got it! <laughs> We captured Doc Ock, but we lost the Green Goblin. Don't worry, we're tracking him. Target located. He's gone to the Oscorp building. What would Green Goblin want in a totally legitimate and entirely unsuspicious office tower like Oscorp? Let's go find out. That won't be necessary, Mr. Richards. Uh, fantastic? Uh... Dr. Richards. Uh, sir. Director Fury needs you and Cap back at the lab. We need to know more about these special bricks and what they can do. Then let's try to figure that out. We've got him. Because with great power comes great responsibility. Within the Oscorp building's high security perimeter, Norman Osborne's labs undertake secretive research into radical new chemical and genetic technologies. What took you so long? Clint, you shouldn't have. Hmm. <laughs> I'm sorry, but you three don't seem to have the proper visitor passes. <laughs> Be on my way shortly. <laughs> wow, getting a visitor pass around here is grueling. You know, for a totally legitimate- And unsuspicious office tower, this place is surprisingly disgusting. You said it. I think that's all of them. Uh, no. I see him! Always love running into you, Spider-Man! Green Goblin, come on! Uh. <laughs> I knew I should have packed my anti-goblin arrows. Legolas! Ha! Can you and the other Avengers track him down? I gotta do dishes, homework, explain to my girlfriend why I am always, always leaving her waiting at coffee places. I mean, my life is really hard. <laughs> Tell me you got the bread. Sorry, sir. The Green Goblin got away. Uh, Colson. I know, sir. Clean up at Oscorp. Tell me you found something. Well, besides going through about a hundred keyboards for Hulk, I've gone through some of my space data about that Silver Surfer we encountered. He was filthy with power cosmic. I was afraid of that. 
And I've tracked the Silver Surfer's power signature from that mystery ship. Looks like they landed in Latveria. Latveria? That means Dr. Doom. Sir, we have a break-in at the raft. Iron Man, Hulk, you're up. Okay, sir. We'll get right on it. Located off Manhattan's east coast, the highest security area of Rikers Island Maximum Security Penitentiary is known as the Raft. Looking for the worst of the worst in super villainy? You'll find them here. My sensors are detecting movement on the other side of this wall. Hulk, drop! You should know by now, he's one of the good guys. Even if he doesn't smell like one. Shouldn't you be in Canada, uncovering your past or something? Tracks Sabertooth here. Chuck says Doom's got the Brotherhood of Mutants helping him out. Doing what? Huh? Just in time for the big escape. <laughs> hmm. Super villains everywhere. Super villains? Meet my super suit. Yes, that suit requires some tailoring. Is it me, or did it just get drafty in here? What a mess. Who else got away? Mm, I'm getting other supervillain sense here. Mandarin, Red Skull, and Loki. Where's Thor? 
in Asgard. He needs to know about this. Mom Zeppel, hi. We've got to save America from the Red Skull. Hulk smash skull! Huh? Hulk rip pants. That's why my red, white, and blue uniform is form-fitting, yet flexible. I love American ingenuity. I have some tracking to do. I'll keep in touch. Or not. Tony, let's get you back to Stark Tower and into something... Uh, less revealing. Oh, I have a great new outfit I put together the other day. Stark Tower dominates the Manhattan skyline as either a highly advanced technological research facility or a giant monument to its owner's ego. Depends who you ask. Did I ever tell you about my party armor? It was designed like a tuxedo, for more formal battles. Honey, I'm home! What's with the hostile welcome? Jarvis, it's me. Your boss man? Intruder alert. Security activated. Intruders? Jarvis, security override command Tango, Oscar Sierra 3963. We're gonna have to fight our way in. Someone must have hacked my systems. It's the kind of thing I do to other people. What the? Arc reactor storage access granted. Loki, stand down! My insincerest apologies, but I need a source of high power at low cost. Well, you are stealing from the best. That's not the only thing we've stolen. Where are you going? Never trust a demigod. Like my suit? I have a soft spot for the oldies. Oh. Why is it my tower can never stay in one piece? We're in danger. The big bad end of the world kind of danger. Initial tests by Reed Richards show that these bricks store the power cosmic and are the remains of the silver surface board. If that means what I think it means, you alone have the expertise we need to help defend the Earth. Looks like both our labs have been trashed. These bad guys love to steal our stuff. And they've been stealing far too much of it. We need to move on our Latveria operation. I call it Operation Latveria. I'll call the rest of the Fantastic Four. Right. Turn on S.H.I.E.L.D.'s arc reactor tracking software. Tracking my arc reactor signatures? Do you know how many times I've had to find you at some crazy party? You see, having the best intelligence gives you the upper hand. Hawkeye, Black Widow, you're up. Standing over 1,400 feet tall and weighing 365,000 tons, the Empire State Building was opened in 1931 and has remained one of New York City's most recognizable landmarks ever since.
Looks like Wolverine beat us here. The signal's gotten stronger, so follow it, agents. This could be a problem. Hey, you guys need any help? It works. Power levels are stable. Excellent. Red Skull, I'm gonna spangle you till you see stars. Still in that ridiculous outfit. You need a bigger wardrobe budget. You cannot defeat me. I picked up the Skull's trail outside the raft. He wears a stinky cologne. We appreciate the help. But you've destroyed the Vortex. Now we can't follow Loki. Yeah, well, I get the sense that Loki isn't just a hired hand in this thing. Sweetness! They'll be fine, Director Fury. They may not be super, but they are heroes. Colonel Fury, sir. Loki jumped into a vortex and vanished. I know someone that can help locate him. Most of what S.H.I.E.L.D. knows about Thor and his people remains highly classified. What little information we've obtained about his home, Asgard, comes from, well, this one children's book found by Dr. Eric Selvig in New Mexico. Seems pretty accurate so far. Get a load of this guy. Ooh, very theatrical with the lightning and everything. He is the god of thunder. It's sort of his thing. I sense the opening of the Vortex because Brother Loki used it as a pathway to Asgard. What the heck's he after? He is ever after only one thing. Power. And also helmets with horns. He's ah. really into those. Heck The Tesseract is dangerous, brother! Oh, and so am I, brother. I intend to get my revenge on you, on Earth, and on Asgard. What are you planning, Loki? You can't make me tell. You are not the god of me. Oh? Thou dost vex me with that taunt. You have used it since we were children. Do you remember this little plaything? <laughs> Return the Tesseract to the safekeeping of the treasure room. Hey, Blondie, I hate to point this out, but it just got stolen from there. Maybe your security is not so good. 
Shield has an entire battalion of troops dedicated to guarding the Tesseract. Humans, guarding this item of immense power. Please, I can rain thunder and lightning on anyone who touches it. That this glow cube can help me find Magneto. I can ask Chuck about that. The final pieces are coming together. Soon you will rule the Earth. Yes, yes. But where is the power source you promised me? It's all we need. I know where it is. We can acquire it from the mutants. The X-Men? Very well. I've planned for every contingency. I'll dispatch some associates to reacquire it. Brought you something, Professor. Figure this can help us find Magneto. The only thing I think it will find for us is unwanted attention. Oh dear. Oh, that doesn't sound good. And that doesn't look good. Officially, Professor Charles Xavier's Institute for Higher Learning is an ordinary boarding school. But the truth is, it also serves as a home and shelter for young mutants with extraordinary powers, collectively known as the X-Men. Come on, we need to rescue the students. Professor! Professor X has agreed to let me care for the Tesseract. He has? Of course. He knows I'm good with technology. And he knows you'll double-cross him at the drop of your helmet. <laughs> well, that's no way to treat a lady, Summers. Make sure the children are protected. I'll take care of these two. No running in the hallway, please. Oh! How many times must I say it? No running in the hallways! Oh. Beautiful, isn't it? You seem to have upset the natives. Deal with them. Oh, my stars and garters. What does that even mean? Magneto got away. That is most unfortunate. I think that means we'll owe Nick Fury a few favors. Thanks for sending Agent Coulson to help with the cleanup here. You were assisting S.H.I.E.L.D. at the time. Besides, I can expense it. But there's something else I need you to help me with. Magneto has stolen the Tesseract and we've tracked its energy signature to Latveria. It's finally time for Operation Latveria to get underway. Why'd it take so long to plan? Approvals, counter signatures, four rounds of notes. You can't believe the bureaucracy I deal with. If Doom combines the power of the Tesseract with those cosmic bricks... It could be very dangerous. He has to be stopped. Yeah, it's... That, no, not yet. Are you going to tell them, sir? One threat at a time, Coulson.
Deep in Central Europe lies a small nation known as Latveria, ruled by Victor Von Doom. Don't let the rustic look of Dr. Doom's castle fool you. It has incredibly advanced weaponry hidden behind its stone walls. Even really good internet. You call it the Fantastica? Whew. Nice. Does it come with satellite radio? We're entering Latverian airspace. Local weather is dreary with an 80% chance of bad guys. And a 100% chance of incoming fire. Setting the fantastic car to autopilot so we can jump in. Human Torch and I will secure the landing zone. I saw this in a movie once. <sighs> Green goblins here. Doom's hiring every baddie he can find. I wonder what kind of benefits he offers. Must be decent. He's got an army of security guards, too. Ben, I believe some clobberin's in order. Ah, oh, Sue! You ruined my line! What? No Spider-Man? Shit! I do so enjoy winding him up. <laughs> Fools! Don't force me to use Dr. Doom's Doom Ray! Of doom. Does that look like a ray gun to you, Reed? Usually ray guns use focused light, whereas this appears to use cosmic energy. Why don't you just ask him? Villains love to talk about their stuff. Hey, Doom, what is that thing? Oh, you'd like to see it in action? Very well. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> Shield Helicarrier, this is Fury. Hill, are you there? Here, sir. Listen, we've located our silver friend. We'll bring him back to the carrier. Doom is taking off with Loki. That's a bad match. Bad for us, I mean. Can you locate them? We can. Just like you can track me anywhere, apparently. Uh, they're headed out to sea, sir. Contact Professor X and see if he can spare some mutants to help us track down all of Doom's associates. Yes, sir. Ah! Shield research submarines are extremely useful for taking the fight to bad guys while underwater. These subs feature advanced tracking equipment, ideal for locating enemies or items of interest. Where exactly are you sending me on my date with Thor? A shield research submarine. A research vessel covered with weapons. Well, that's deceptive labeling. Not our research cell. Whoa. Uh -huh. Don't tell me. You got here on a really long spider line. Uh, no. 
you're not the only one that can fly. Compliments of Mr. Nick Fury and S.H.I.E.L.D. You know, I could fit you with a rocket-propelled iron suit if you like. Hmm. Sounds... heavy. I cannot call down any lightning inside this vessel. We're trapped. Worry not, Thor. My telekinesis can separate water molecules. You just open the hatch. Oh, really? With the banging? Really? Hey, Doc, why do you need all those cosmic bricks? I don't share my plans with insects. How about a god then? To mind your manners around a lady. Yes, yes, it's on my to-do list. I know why you're here, Silver Surfer. But I'm still not sure what Loki and Doom want with your boss. Reed Richards and Hulk are ready to stop Lady Liberty. Are you sure you want Wolverine on this operation? I know cooperation isn't in his nature, but we need him. Roxxon undisputedly leads the world in energy production. Its power plant, located a short distance from New York, is rumored to contain some kind of experimental reactor core. Come, my mutant brothers. We need to core this nuclear plant. <laughs> Hulk! Punch, big lady! Hulk, be careful! She's a national oh. treasure! 
and her hat is really pointy! this copper-clad footwear. Hey, watch it, bub! Get off! Hey, we're inside the statue. You know, I've lived in New York all this time and I've never been inside this thing. Allow me to give you the tour. Look, down there, Magneto has exposed the nuclear core. Sir, Magneto desecrated the Statue of Liberty. What is this country coming to? Captain Rogers, I will personally oversee retrieving Lady Liberty and put her back together. You have my word. If Magneto is involved in this thing, I'm betting he wants that nuclear core to make Asteroid M operational. Doom must be building some space-based weapon and he needs the transport. You ready, Captain? Good to go, sir. So long as the ever-loving blue-eyed thing here will lend a hand. Sweet Aunt Petunia, I'll lend you both hands, Cap. It's clobbering! Not quite yet. Wait until you get there. Now get to the flight line. Black Widow has arranged transport. Unfortunately, little intelligence exists concerning this mysterious island. For some reason, it doesn't appear on our maps, and we have very good maps. Lots of vegetation and some evidence of military structures, but that's about all. boys. Why land at all? It's more fun to jump! The package has been delivered, Director Fury. to see me and my island rise! He's quite the showman. And he's got a flying island? Is this some sort of Hydra trick? Like I know. Just hang on!
Captain America. Thing. Charles Xavier sends his regards. Storm. Hey, the weather goddess ain't such a bad trade-up. Especially for Johnny. <laughs> What's that metal pendant gun doing? Enhancing his powers or something? Well then, let's depower him. <laughs> Mystique. Of course. That should hold her. So, where'd Magneto go? I see that a rise in elevation does not equate to a rise in one's IQ, Benjamin. We have arrived. Hardly palatial, but it will do. Let's see to the final assembly, and to my final revenge. Your revenge? You mean my rule? <laughs> yes, I misspoke. Remind me not to make the submarine toss a part of my Starkland theme park, okay? And yet you're keeping the Iron Man musical. Magneto must pay. Calm down, calm down. We don't want you hulking out on us. I need to report back to the professor. Uh, hello? Nick Fury? Paging Nick Fury. Nicholas Fury. Can I bill you for that shield submarine you turned into scrap? Bill Magneto. Where is he, by the way? He's got some payback coming. He, Doom, and Loki are on a heavily defended floating asteroid, assembling what we think is a giant super weapon. Don't these guys ever just go get a latte? Play some chess in the park. I built a new flying toy that's perfect for this. I call it the... Let me guess. The Stark Jet? How'd you know? Stark Tower, Stark Industries, Stark Land. Call it a hunch. <sighs> That's Magneto's space station, Asteroid M. We don't know much about it, but it is sure to be swarming with bad guys and booby traps. Any S.H.I.E.L.D. agent attempting to gain entry should proceed with extreme caution. Hey guys, hope you don't mind. No hot water at the apartment. This location is indeed perfect. You do know he's the god of mischief. His involvement is vital to my rule of this earth. You can be in charge of metal recycling. Huh? <sighs> Intruders! I will deal with them. Doctor Doom, our victory is nigh. Really? How did Doom get preferred parking? Let's tell him. I come to my lovely asteroid M, but I don't get a housewarming gift. 
I say thee nay! Good luck magnetizing Thor's god hammer. Oh, and I've demagnetized my armor just for this occasion. Yeah, I took a bath. That's all I did. None of my mutant kin here to betray their race. Oh, what a delightful change of pace. Doctor Doom, I require your assistance. Ignore him. We must focus on the task at hand. Oh dear. I know why you're here. How do we prevent your boss from making Earth his lunch? My board. What does Doom want with it? Loki. Using the power cosmic. Hmm. We have almost no chance of saving Earth even with your help. Our best hope is to stop Doom before his plan moves forward. I've put in a call for outside help. The lab looks great. This is Agent Hill from S.H.I.E.L.D. Director Fury is in urgent need of your assistance. Agent Coulson is on his way to pick up Magneto. We'll be right there. Mother? Can I get a rabbit? What? Where am I? <sighs> I'll get the broom. Could I have a broom also? And some cheese, please. We've collated all of our data from every S.H.I.E.L.D. agent and Avenger throughout the world. And we've managed to ascertain that Doctor Doom is definitely up to something bad. I know that's not much to go on, but it is a start, right? We're facing a planetary catastrophe that may soon be unleashed by Dr. Doom. He must be stopped. My time is at hand. Soon all on Earth will bow to Doom. The Earth. It's such an important part of my revenge. Thanks, but we'll do all the avenging around here. And looky, Loki and his pal have a big bad mega weapon. You simpletons have no idea the danger that is right in front of you. I have created this Doom Ray to defend the planet from destruction. Also to destroy all resistance to my benevolent rule. Defend the Earth? From what? I'll hold them off. You finish my weapon. Excellent suggestion. Fools! This place is mine to rule! Hey, spider-like agility at your service. You can't possibly defeat me alone. Who says he's alone? It's not time for clobbering. I have work to do. Remind me not to take the scenic route next time. End of the line, metalhead. Pathetic worms. Bow before your savior of Earth, Dr. Doom! It cannot be! I'm... I'm Doctor Doom! Sorry, Doc, but you know what? It's finally clobbering time! <laughs> huh? 
Brother Loki, Doom's plan has failed. Abandon his weapon! <laughs> Doom's plan? A weapon? Lightning you have. Imagination you don't. Nice hat. Galactus, devourer of worlds. Not mine, but... I am hunger. Finally, my vengeance will be realized on your pathetic planet. I will harness the power of Galactus. He will have the Earth for breakfast and Asgard for lunch. Wow, he's gonna be pretty full. That's quite a lot of protein, even for a big guy. This, all oh, this, brother, all a sad plan for revenge on Earth, on Asgard? Yes, brother. I sat in my prison cell, plotting my revenge, thinking, planning, convincing Dr. Dumb to do my bidding. And you never saw it coming. Now, behold my genius! Okay, people, let's go to work. Avengers, assemble! Yes, a giant alien being is attempting to eat our planet with the help of a Norse god. I'm on it. Thank you for calling S.H.I.E.L.D. Can you hold, please? Thank you for calling S.H.I.E.L.D. Please hold. Gentlemen, the situation is dire. I welcome any ideas. You've got to be more flexible in your thinking, Director. Maybe the bad guys can help. I guess technically that's a bad idea. Ironic. I mean, if Earth is gone, who do they have to menace with evil plots? Each other? Hello. Doc, it's Nick Fury. I have a proposal for you and your friends. Get Abomination and Magneto and take them to Doom. Sounds like a risky venture to me. And I'm all about risky ventures. I hope Fury knows what he's doing. I tend not to play well with people who've been attacking me and trying to steal all my stuff. Were we only children again? I would resolve this by giving Loki what you mortals call a wedgie. But I fear the forceful elevation of undergarments will not save us now. Maybe not, but I'd pay good money to see that. Well, if it isn't two mighty Avengers, seeking the help of Emil Blonsky! Pretty sure Magneto there will prove much more useful. You're just along for the ride. Now, can we get on with this? I suppose assisting you is preferable to the entire planet being destroyed, if only marginally. Doom's insisting on taking his own jet to fight Galactus. Can't say I'll ever understand villains and their demands, but there's no time to argue. Head over to the financial district and meet it. You heard the man. Time to move. Don't fall behind. Galactus, devourer of worlds. If our own intelligence is to be believed, we got it off an internet site, he is as old as the universe itself. His hunger is unrelenting and will consume any planet unfortunate enough to cross his path. That can't be good.
vengeance is mine, puny creatures! Kneel before me! Okay, folks, this is our last shot. Make it count. spending cube but I'll bet we could have some fun I'll take that thanks can we talk about this no I bet you taste minty and cool I need a palate cleanser time to face some justice remember our bargain fury yes you all get a head start while the good guys count to 30. That's the deal you made. Hulk, start counting. Uh, one, two, three. Yes, not a bad deal, I must say. Though I think that... We're on the clock. Uh, three, three, three. Here you go, Surfer. We reconstructed it from the cosmic bricks. I will use it to find Galactus and set him on a course away from Earth. Ride the cosmic waves, my friend. Once more, the world is safe and the heroes have saved the day. And that true believer is exactly how it should have ended. I appreciate you answering our distress call, but the Avengers and their allies just defeated Galactus. That's not why we're here. There's something else. Fire Brute! Right. Nice. 